Miles Walter Keogh was born on March 25, 1840 in Lachlan Bridge, County Carlow, Ireland and died on June 25, 1876 aged 36 at the Battle of Little Bighorn in Montana in the United States of America. Campaigns fought, War of Italian Unification, in the Papal Army at the Battle of Castelfidardo on September 18, 1860 along with 1,000 fellow Irishmen known as the Expedition of the Thousand, then becoming a Vatican Guard from 1860 to 1862. Awards received, Pro Petri received Medal for Gallantry and the Knight of the Order of St. Gregory the Great. Campaigns continued, from 1862 to 1865 in the American Civil War. Battle of Port Republic at the rank of Captain, Second Battle of Bull Run, Battle of Antietam, Stoneman's 1863 Raid, Gettysburg Campaign, Battle of Brandy Station, Battle of Upperville and the Battle of Gettysburg where he was promoted to Major. Campaigns continued, from 1862 to 1865 in the American Civil War. Battle of Funkstown, Battle of Williamsport, Bristow Campaign, Atlanta Campaign, Battle of Dallas where he was promoted to Lieutenant Colonel at the age of 24, Battle of Kennesaw Mountain and the Battle of Sunshine, commands after the Civil War. He ended the war as Brevet Lieutenant Colonel and chose to remain on active duty accepting a commission as a second lieutenant in the 4th Cavalry on May 4, 1866. Commands after Civil War, continued. On July 28, 1866 he was promoted to captain and reassigned to the 7th Cavalry at Fort Riley in northeast Kansas where he took command of Company I. Campaigns continued. The Indian Wars, Battle of the Little Bighorn, 25th to 26th July 1876. Fighting alongside Custer in what would become Custer's last stand, Keogh was the only Irish officer to fight in the battle alongside over 100 fellow Irishmen. The Battle of the Little Bighorn, 25th to 26th July 1876. Hoping for a quick victory, Custer split his forces of over 600 men into four groups, himself taking 210 men, including Keogh in what would become known as, Custer's Last Stand. Unknowingly facing overwhelming forces of over 2,500 to 6,000 Indians from Lakota Sioux, Northern Cheyenne and Arapaho tribes, Custer and his 210 men including Keogh were all killed in less than one hour. All fallen soldiers' bodies were mutilated except for Miles Keogh, probably because he was wearing his pro Petri seed medal and was considered a holy or medicine man. So revered was this medal that Sitting Bull wore it till his death. Sitting Bull took and wore Keogh's medal until his death in 1890. Keogh's horse Comanche is considered the only U.S. military survivor of the battle. Comanche would become the 7th Cavalry's regimental mascot. Comanche died in 1891 aged 29 and was given a military funeral with full military honors. His remains were not buried but instead sent to the University of Kansas and preserved, where his taxidermy mount can still be seen today in the university's Natural History Museum. Thirty-four Irish-born men from over twenty counties across Ireland fell in the Battle of Little Bighorn alongside Miles Keogh. The Irish, over one hundred, were the biggest contingent of migrant soldiers to take part in the battle. Close to twenty different nationalities took part in the battle. On a side note, in 1918, Miles Keogh's great-nephew Michael Keogh was a field lieutenant in the Bavarian 16th Infantry Regiment in the German Army and was awarded the Hindenburg Cross. In 1919 while in charge of the Munich barracks he was called to quell a riot that had broken out in the gymnasium. The Irishman was informed the catalyst for the unrest was a young corporal who had unwisely attempted to woo soldiers with his fascist rantings ahead of upcoming municipal elections. 
the mob were beating the corporal stamping on his head and body and ready to bayonet him. Kyo along with seven armed men volleyed gunshots above the soldiers' heads and they fled the scene. The Irishman instructed the corporal he was arresting and placing him in the guardroom for his own safety. Unfortunately Michael Keogh just saved the life of a 30-year-old Adolf Hitler. Please like and subscribe. See links in description for further information and for link to my video on the Battle of Antietam.